Salam, welcome back. So glad to see you again. Ready to learn another song? Let's get right into it. The song which we will learn now is Masha Allah from Ekta Tiger. This song is originally played on Darbuka and is one of the best songs to play on this instrument. This is fun and a groovy song and is played at 110 beats per minute. This is how it sounds. Trust me, you'll be playing exactly like me in the next 20 minutes. Ready? Let's get right into it. Just like last song, we used fills in this song too. But this time you've used it with respect to how the music is played. Now what do I mean when I say with respect to how the music is played? This is an important aspect in music which you should learn and understand. Now, Just because you've learned so much, it doesn't necessarily mean that you have to play this on every part of the song. You have to remember that you'll have to play for the song and not just with the song. For example, if a song is emotional and slow, it doesn't really sound great if you play 16 notes throughout. Or for instance, if a song is a dance song, then it doesn't make sense if you play a soft and slow beat to it. Are you getting it? Hence, it is important that you understand how the song feels before you start playing it. Always remember this when you're playing your next song. And talking about songs, let's see how the pattern of Mashallah looks like. For this song, we'll use Saidi as a bass and fill in a lot of spaces with the text and the cars. Refer to the tab and let's understand the pattern. As you all know, doom, tech on the one and the end of one. The next doom, doom is on the end of two and the three. The last tech is on the four. Now let's add extra text on the two on the AND of 3 and on the AND of 4. For the cars, we'll add them on the E of 2, E uh of 3 and E uh of 4. For the fill, we'll use a simple yet powerful fill which is DOOM 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 and this will be played on the 3, AND of 3 and on the 4 in a particular part of the song which you will know when we'll practice. Now that you've understood the pattern, let's set the metronome at 60 beats per minute and I'll help you count it first. One. 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1 E and a 2 E and a 3 E and a 4 E and a 1 E and a 2 E and a 3 E and a 4 E and a. Great, now let's apply the pattern on the dabuka at same 60 beats per minute. 1 E and a 2 E and a 3 E and a 4 E and a. Amazing. Now let's try this at the original tempo of 110 beats per minute. With me. 1, 2, 3, 4. One, two, three. Amazing. Now let's practice the fill with the same 110 beats per minute. With me. 1, 2, 3, 4. One, two, three, four. Fantastic! Now let's add the fill and the pattern together and practice. For the first four times, we'll use the fill. For the next four times, we'll use the pattern. With me. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Wonderful. Now let's try this with the song and to make it easy I will count 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 
I like how this is sounding. Now let's try this again, but this time I will not count. With me. Wow, that was so, so, so good. I had so much fun playing this song and I'm sure even you did too. Please refer to the music sheets and audio clips to help you in your practice. And remember to submit your videos in the assignment section. I will personally review it and tell you how well you're doing. Can't wait to see them. Follow us on Instagram at crack.ai for more fun and learning content. You can also upload your Dabuka videos there and tag us. For a few lucky people will get a chance to have a live interaction with me. See you soon!